<laughs> that might help. <laughs> yes, that might good. help. Yeah. <laughs> and it's... Okay. I stand away now. We lower this a slight bit here. If you're lowering that, you should lower game size as well. Well, this is just how this picks up. How much this picks up. Right? So, like... We're, we're, we're here. We're here. This is good. Um, we, we gotta say the thing. Welcome to the Weber State Weekly. It is January 9th, 1st I, I of 2024. Don't know, I don't know what they're cooking right now. No? How do we change this? Oh, um... It is... I know how to do this. We have to manually change the source of OBS. No, wait. Oh, wait, no, it, it was just scrolled down. That's why. Uh, Save. Edge on. Uh, do you want me to use bioluminescence? Uh, oh, bioluminescent. I'm having a great time here. Spelling check? Yeah, I'll do BIO. Okay. I know how to do it. It's just so. It's such a small square. It's such a small square for such a big name. Such a small room for such a big personality. We should kick him out. I need another we stream neighbor today. Listen, listen. People always go, uh. Yeah. Personality. As big as a personality as I can get. You're making a new tag because you're playing on stream. Is this why our is this why our brackets always run late? It's not because I made 13 memes so far and never yeah. a single one. Oh, I be fighting when they ask rest or thigh, you say personality, and the person serving the Winco chicken is just confused. Yeah. Oh, we get to judge. We get to judge controls. Don't worry, I'm already having my own breakdown. Mash did. They both they both use pro controllers. I'm already judging them. Ah, got to judge. Hey, the, the best Smash player, Akala is a, a pro controller player. Yeah. Yeah. I'm more. It, it's. Whoa. Dog. You guys are on stream in the joke. Guys, Diamond Iron is here? That's what I was saying. He pulled up, and I'm like. I would die for Ethan. You know, Ethan and I slept in the same bed. That's something to pull out of nowhere. Yeah, and he was married. When was that? Amazing. I will say, Diamond Nara, really good, like, sleeping buddy. He does not kick at all. Oh, nice. He stays in his lane. It's a, it's a very comfortable He doesn't have experience. any, like, mid-sleep right. turns. No sleep talk. Really? Okay, okay. Yeah. What? When you guys get cold, does he make a good snuggle buddy? Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure I was conscious for that part. Ah, gotcha, gotcha. I mean, if it's, uh, I'd imagine you'd remember a nightmare puddle scenario before you remember a good one. So. I, booked, I booked a hotel once for 2GG Hyrule Saga in Smash 4. And I booked it for four people, and I kept saying people could stay in my room if they wanted, and so we had 12 people in my room. And in my own hotel room, I slept in the middle of the bed between Sace and Valor. <laughs> that's, uh, that's quite funny, much like Steve Upair is. Um, I think I saw an up tilt and the Mimmins now. Yeah, good combo. <laughs> much skill required. Honestly, yeah. Me. Yeah. I, I think Steve's pretty hard to play, Un unironically. I, I mean, think, yeah. I, I think, like, I see what Prince does, and I'm like, I couldn't do that. He's he's fast. I don't think he's difficult, but he's fast. Mm -hmm. You have to do his stuff fast, so. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm really impressed with Prince's tech, like, in general. Like, his setups, I yeah. think, are really creative. Yeah, you have, like, Prince has you off the ledge, and he goes creative there. mode. Yeah. Yeah. His, his ledge play is really impressive. The way he does watch him, impressive. Edge is pulling this up pretty decent, though. I think this match is, like, even-ish, right? Min -min -win. Min -min -win. Ooh. I mean, I'd imagine blocks just trivialize Min, -min though. I, she can punch him with her big noodle arms. That's true. That's true. That was close. Like, you normally blocks would trivialize Min Min if Min Min didn't have the second arm at all times. You just throw out when you want. Yeah. As your coverage. Prince gets a lot of um, mileage. Every time I kill him, he that uh, side B grab and up smash is most of his stocks. Yeah. Which is good. That That's something he's really good at is, like, mixing up the minecarts. Because, like, 
most Steve's minecart in the minecart place, but he'll mix up the timing a little bit, just yeah. enough to throw you off and get the grab. Well, I mean, you play ZSS, you have to be as precise as ever, I'm sure, with a little more forgiving character, you have Maybe. a bit of an Zero suit kind of dumpster, Steve. But yeah. Really good uh, conversion on the up smash there with the block. That was really fast. Yeah. Just often to use those resources yeah. instead of default. Oh, that nice. Good up smash. I, that's one of Minmin's faster moves. Yeah. Uh, no, broken uh, move. Top, yeah. top five up smash. Yeah. Honestly. Prince with a little bit of a lead here, but Edge is doing a really good job pushing him to the corner. And I think that's where Minmin's really going to thrive in this matchup. Is I'm if you get a good, like, megawatt or something. I'm surprised as much as they've been using uh, the Ram Ram that it doesn't snipe out the minecart as much when its coverage is so high yeah. and, like, minecart can be pretty telegraphed. Yeah, right there. He's it's just threading the needle. Yeah. Seems kind of inconsistent. Yeah, just a little bit of there. That's something that, like, you know, like, I was talking with Speedy once, and, like, if you don't know the Min Min matchup, you don't know, like, how her lag works once she throws out one move. But right there, I'm pretty sure she wasn't actionable to, like, stop the mind. Right? Interesting. Quick 57. Creative combo with the re-grab in there as well. I like yeah. that. Well, I mean, people are scared. Ooh, that was a good read, honestly. She had the jump read just a little bit late on yeah. the execution. Who would have thought that minecart or uh, Steve back air is a good move? Yeah, she's doing a good job interrupting the, uh, the Steve mining with the dragon on. Nice, good match. Yeah, I was expecting a, an up smash out of that, so it's good to opt for that less laggy move so you can just kind of read the scenario after. Can she, uh, can Mimin up smash and move? Yeah. Once, it, once it's made, the one thing I'm not He so can't sure. be standing on it, right? I think. I think it's still a projectile if he's standing on it. Interesting. I think, yeah, it's the, the anvil's a projectile whether he's on it or not. And uh, if it's reflected while he's on it, it has the strength of Steve standing on it. So you all, if you're Steve, you always want to jump off my part or jump off anvil if you're expecting it because it gets what, weaker the second on, you jump off. What on earth is happening? <laughs> what are they cooking? I, yeah, 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 yeah. You guys made a new rule set, right? Okay, <laughs> that's good. <laughs> the rule set's called like competitive offline. We actually deleted all of the other ones while we were at it because you don't need one after this. <laughs> no, Super Spicer Curry and the Fire Crate. The Fire Crate? Yeah. Oh, I mean, I don't. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Yes. Um, on the podcast episode that we just recorded, when talking about side brackets, uh, Edge brought up doing a side bracket where they dictate the rule set, since you know their sets with um, with Frosty are always like items, final smash meter, and I think that that'd be quite quirky. But judging by the fact that we're seeing this on stream in bracket, do we need it to be side when it's put on front and display for us? <laughs> like regular. <laughs> Right. I think we should do a side bracket, but like you can counter pick um, rule sets. Oh, that'd be interesting. Yeah, so like if you play like a character with an infinite and stamina mode, you can like counter pick them to stamina. Yeah, that'd be interesting. One of the ones that um that we thought up that'd be really nice. We get a few set or few You guys have to hazards are on, right? Yes. I'm gonna make a weak thing. Nothing famous. <laughs> Yeah, something that we thought up. You guys, um, you guys gotta crank up that yeah. HP. No, 150. 150. 150. Wow. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, hey, what are you talking about? You're in Weber State playing Zero Suit Samus. You win. That's, True. The, that's the Weber State character. <laughs> uh, there. If Falco's combos weren't cutscene enough, we have spicy curry. <laughs> oh, the hidden HP is really a, a, that's a nice touch. Yeah, it's it's like a it's like a horror movie. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you're like, will this Falco up till end? Me? Yeah, you're just waiting for the kill spark jump to get her. <laughs> How long does the freaking curry last? Too long. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, that that that. Makes sense. Freest combo breaker. Now, to your 
Ed's refreshing the timer on that. Oh no! Zero Suit sucks! Down Smash doesn't even work after Curry! <laughs> <laughs> Broken character! Down Smash Curry, not a true combo, bottom tier. I wonder if someone's like close to dying. I, they both are. Look at look at the smoke. Look at the smoke. You can see the rage particles. I did want to note I'm impressed by both of these players' honor. Um, neither of them are just sitting at the edge holding shield. That's yeah, yeah. <laughs> the walk off classic. For sure. I mean the biggest thing. Oh in no, high it's unpunishable. Oh. Ooh. oh. There's the final smash. He prefers the air. No! <laughs> the good question is, does it kill? We yes. don't know. That was oh, awesome. And that's game. It's We're looking 2-0 bioluminescent. I'm going to make sure the rules set is... Uh... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You do that. Anyways, put me on the mic. How's it going, Mike? My match is over. So, uh, post post uh, match thoughts right there. Um, it was one one, but Prince cheated. I can't believe he did that. Wow. Yes. Oh no. My 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 com my co commentators le left me. Oh, we are. I was just changing the rules. <laughs> All right. Well, it's time to commentate. So this is wow. This can just detect both of us. Huh? Yeah. Ethan, it's good to see you. Yes, I am here. Are you still on that zero suit arc? Uh, a little bit. I've been getting on uh quick play for ZSS a few times. Yo. Uh, was one match away, and then through the match, it was like against like a Lucas that I definitely could have beat, but. <laughs> <laughs> It was, it was one of those moments where I was like, okay, this is a bad player, and I beat him as like 20 other characters, but like, I don't know ZSS well enough, so. <laughs> so I still gotta keep learning. I accidentally hit the mic, so I hope when Beta watches uh, this later, it's not now. loud. Okay, there we go. Oh, gross, they're playing. K. Rule and Joker. Real. This is this is the matchup. I, I see. I'm a little mad that they aren't on one stock, 150 stamina, <laughs> but okay. But the yep did say a while ago he would have his Joker arc, and here it is. Y uh, yeah. <laughs> see, seeing the Joker come out, gonna you know steal some hearts, Phantom Thieves persona. I play those games. Yeah, that's right. Really? I don't talk to people. <laughs> And great job from Yep, just like getting the lead here. First thing in this match, Ari has Koleoman almost at 100%. He's just been juggling him, comboing him, just like that. Trying to get some sort of edge guard right there. Doesn't really get it. Rebels. I think he was just trying to get some rebels yeah. guard off the uh, uh, propeller. The upbeat, yeah, but like, I'm kind of surprised it didn't even hit him at all. It just sometimes Carol just snaps ledge and sometimes he doesn't. It's yeah, Carol's like really inconsistent. That's why he's kind of bad. <laughs> See, if only yeah, well, he I'm... lived in a post K or a pre patch Carol world. Um, so, oh, wow, that kill. That did not look like it should have, but no, it should I, not. It also have. didn't look like he was able to di. <laughs> like, no, it just looked like he just outright died for no reason. Trying to counter the propeller there. It hit him that time, but the counter didn't end up coming out at the right time there. Yeah, I can speak English. Please, let's find that. This down smash. Why, why did Sakurai just like discover that that was a down smash they could do and be like, I got to put this on everybody. Oh, there's <laughs> so many characters. It's like, that's a cool idea. Let's put it on like seven characters. I think it's just so funny how like consistent it is across like ultimate newcomers. Yeah. No, because let's see, K. Rool's got it, Incense has got it, Sora's got it. Yeah. There's got to be more. I think there's, uh, not Plant. Plant is a heavy. Oh, Ow. great punish. Boxy glove to the face right there. Call him, I don't know any boxers, Mike Tyson. <laughs> <laughs> Call him Mike Tyson. Call him Little Mac, except he can actually recover. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
but he's not gonna be able to recover from oh. that one. Yep, I, I guessed it. There's the edge guard. That back air, especially with that arc stun, is so good. It's been said time and time again by every single person on the planet, and I'm just repeating it because it's such a true statement. And that Nair is really good combo breaker as well. The thing is, you got that little bit of that armor, and then it just goes through it. Forward smash gonna hit nobody. I don't know what that was. I love seeing the like. The like little turnarounds where the, uh, like Mars does that all the time, where he'll be like trying to bait someone, and he'll just like do a little bit of that in the middle of his combo to like throw people off and be like, "Am I gonna read a roll? Am I gonna just F smash? Like, what am I gonna do?" Oh Down gun. Oh, but he. Austin, I can't against... believe that no one died. Yeah, that I was expecting one death, and I was honestly expecting death. But he gets the kill. The kill, the kill screen did not look quite right, but the frame before it at least made sense. Yeah. So it's like, okay. Great first game for these both these two. That was yeah. really fun. And yep, honestly, just getting those great combos off and everything. But Coley Men still being able to answer back. It's like we're going to Battlefield. I, I Joker, although, uh, wait, and I sat down the <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> I a got joke something today. cooking here. Like, wait, is this character? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm broken in a good I way. I can't believe the that Omen, after uh, two two games of uh, Steve, is just like, nah, not Steve here. <laughs> I know. Because, it... like, I... Well, here's the thing. I don't know. I don't think Steve really has any losing matchups. I don't know if it's like better for K. Roll than for Steve, but in my like, I would imagine that almost anything is better for Steve than for yeah. K. Roll. Yeah, <laughs> like, like, like I could definitely see the like change up for like comfortability. Say like you know he's more used to fighting like Jokers or ZSSs or whatever. Yeah. K. Roll. But then and, again, what am I criticizing when he took one hit that whole stock? Yeah. <laughs> and he takes it great, and then you know Yep trying to start up a combo of his own here, but can Cole even get that extra percent and maybe even another stock off? There's the ground off the wall. I that's something you can do apparently. Yep, trying to go for an edge guard here. Oh not gonna gosh, get that it though. Looks so scary. I know. Off <laughs> when both players are off stage and dating each other, it's like always a mini heart attack. You never really know what's gonna be happening. Yeah, especially with uh, our. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Everything was taken. There's the back air. That's all gone. right. Kudos, kudos to Yep for not getting his shield broken. Yeah, good job there. And that was that was very scary for sure. And then uh, Coleman didn't even get that much percent on Yep before his stock got taken. He was at what, like 50? Then of course that extra 20 percent from you know whatever Coleman hit him with. There's that back there. Slide on the ground. Tries to get. Oh, doesn't get the edge guard. And there's down gun. It's not gonna be hitting anything though. Do you ever look at the old down gun hitbox and like remember what it once was? Yeah. <laughs> I see that sometimes and I'm like, oh my gosh, how did this ever get okayed? <laughs> I know, that, that down, I'm old jokers. Is old. <laughs> For a second I thought we were about to see the, uh, the frame perfect ladder thing. That would have been awesome. Oh boy. Has of all much, yep, off stage. What can Coley Omega here? Is that the Nair? Oh, Text it! The tech? And the R7 gonna help him recover right there. There's back, Yeet. and that's gonna kill. <laughs> he was at 150, so like, kind of expected. There's down gun. Still, again, not as good as it used to be. Oh my gosh. Oh <laughs> my gosh! Oh my they God. Why? Oh my god. What was he at? Was he at zero? It was something close to it was real early. Oh my heck. I can't no. believe that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're seeing town here. I don't need it. I don't need it. I need it! <laughs> Again, as per usual, yep. An emergency case to break <laughs> out child. <laughs> Alright, well, let's see if the let's see if the nest uh here actually works out for yet. Or Coleoven gets a really early game again. Wow. Oh. 
got it. But, six, but Yep is at 69%, and that's a funny number. And that might help him out to get some crazy damage here. Oh, oh. no. Oh, Easy my gaming. gosh. <laughs> no. Ah. That's you so hate sad. To see that. Does that count as an SD? One SD counter for me. So close to that. Oh, my gosh. How did he get out of that and not have to air dodge directional? Yeah. What? Okay. And how did what is going on? I don't... This is... This how, match is, like, stranger than last. How, how is Koleoman doing this? I don't... What is He's happening? cheating, guys. He messed with the hitbox. There's that up throw coming in. Yep, but that 69% again. Is he gonna SD with it? Oh, no, my. Oh, what a tech. Great important. tech. There's the PK fire. Good again. important PK fire. He might have gotten spiked if he didn't do oh, that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's another PK fire. There's the backers coming in. Okay. What was that? I, I think he wouldn't have died if he didn't air dodge there. Yeah. I think he did it instinctively. I could see that. It looked like he was close enough that he might have survived without air dodge, but... Case, that... case in point, I, I think uh, Yep would have died there if he did air dodge. Yeah. But look, look at that. Just K real fair. It doesn't matter. So, yeah, you're going to die there anyways, whether it's the crocodile kicking you. And there's... Yep. Try to get to the crocodile. Oh my gosh. Oh, but okay, there's a buddy, catching him. Important? Important? All right. Yep, yeah, gonna start trying to drag Pulliam across the stage. There's the PK fire. There's another PK fire. Oh, play. good job. He's yep, so cool, guys. This back. Yeah, this is basically an even game here. Unless Pulliam gets something crazy. No, it's just 40%. But you know, that's still a lead. It's still better than nothing, but... We love PK fire at ledge. Oh, yep. Yeah. Classic. As as a arc fire at ledge kind of guy myself, uh, I think that like yeah, it's just like we we may be cringe, but we are free type thing, you know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's. Okay. Oh my goodness. Off stage again. Trying to just go for a ledge trap there. Depends to get anything. Colby just gonna try safely land with that nair. K roll classic right there. He's gaming. There's the PK thunder coming in. Can't air dodge past that one. In. Oh, okay. He was, he was trying to read which air dodge and just didn't get the Wait, right there's direction. The back air? But that's it. Oh, that's 2 0, oh, <laughs> 2 1, sorry, 4 yet. That oh was a great gosh. set. Wow. What just what a time. What a time. <laughs> After he was better than me, like, when he was on the come up, I was like, oh yeah, okay, well. And then he was like ranked 8. And I take this, I'd be like, oh, <laughs> one Coley open. I have to do I don't think it's the worst. Alright. Dakon Beta on stream? I want Dakon Beta stream. Dakon Beta on stream? When I got both K rolls, I get to down for them. I, I need I need Dakon Beta on stream. I need to commentate that. Beta? On stream? Beta on stream? Yeah, go beta, go. Here he is, the man, the myth, the legend. Our yeah. editor. Yeah, beta, put that in the highlights. <laughs> <laughs> That's my editor. That's my TO. That's my TO. That is my TO. I know that guy. I know that guy. Hungry Box walked past him once. He almost he almost ran into Hungry Box in bracket. He almost got the chance to eliminate Hungry Box from bracket if a random PT didn't. Uh, lose to Hungry Box instead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that w seriously, I would have been so happy if you eliminated HBox from losers that in, so funny. at level up. That would have been the uh, that would have been the dream. <laughs> Yo, PS2 Ultimate Classic. Y'all don't even know how close it was. It was like if HBox lost one game in winners, it was like. Uh, beta was his next game in losers. Like it was that close. <laughs> oh, I'm seeing the beta Mario coming out here. Another you know, duck hunt. Okay. We love to see the classics. Here we are. We love to see this matchup. Hype. Oh, as per usual. Okay. And you know, if duck hunt, if someone else was playing duck hunt, it wouldn't be hype. But for some reason, when <laughs> duck hunt touches this character. Like it's actually entertaining to watch somehow. So I I think I think part of that is just like you have to really commit to maining duck hunt because yeah. if you don't like you don't know you don't know how to do the duck hunt stuff. M almost everyone who plays duck hunt for a little bit is not maining him. They aren't even secondarying him. They aren't even like 
their top 40 character in the game. It's like, <laughs> this is the person I get off random and like I had fun on one match, so I'm, I'll play him one more time type thing, you know? Yeah. But but Doc Hunt is committed. He's he's learned all the stuff. Oh, ah, he's so cool. But look at Veda. Veda. <laughs> Who cares if Doc Hunt's, you know, committed to Doc Hunt? When Veda just gets a combo like that with that. Like, oh, uh -oh yeah, that but look at this. This is just what he did uh, against that Palu that got into Yeet Smash that one time. <laughs> Alright, and okay, Doc Hunt really needs to secure a kill here before Beta gets off something crazy. There's the can not it's gonna very reach him! Close, but yeah, now he's not at like good can throw percents. Yeah, it, he's good at he's at good kill percent, but like No, he's at way too high percent for like any of classic like, combo. Yeah, yeah, it won't work anymore. Of course now Mario's got a little bit of that raid. Oh, no. Oh gosh, I see all these okay. like air dodges and I'm like, if beta reads one thing, it's so over. Yeah, it's it's literally Jover. <laughs> okay, there's the ladder. Ah! Oh, no up to finish off that. Okay. Misses the reply. Kudos to Doc Hunt for like making the air dodges work. Oh he, yeah. He has not gotten up air on any of the air dodges yet. Ooh, and great combos yeah. there from Doc. That's something, again, the combos are so- ah! the He gets so the read. Think, can Doc Hunt like really come in here and get this comeback, or is Beta just gonna you know keep going for this lead? Because again, it's always you know they get to those even stocks when Beta takes it first. Oftentimes, yeah. That said, I know that there's like ridiculous stuff that Doc uh, knows how to do. Oh yeah. Even just uh, Duck Hunt up there, just very silly. <laughs> I can't believe he didn't uh -huh. get hit by Ken there. Yeah, went the wrong way, which you hate to see that if you're a Doc Hunt fan. And Ken just, I love it when Ken just blows up in the most random places. Up there won't kill at 150. Oh Bad character alert. Bad character. <laughs> 172. Bit is oh the one. Has to watch gosh. out for the Ken. Did, that, no did, did you see that up there though? That was, that was such a good up there. Yeah, to kick the Ken away. Okay, oh, he'll finally the secure. He'll finally secure the kill. Okay, but Beta I, got a good 58 on him. Yeah, I know Duck can drain this percentage back relatively quick. Oh, no, but okay. it is and not uh, sweet spot, not sweet spot. Duck is still okay. in this. Good, good. Oh, oh but there's a forward smash. Beta takes game one here. The worst part is that, like, you saw him get hit by the frisbee. So, like, Duck Hunt was, like, a few frames off from, like, that being safe. Yeah. <laughs> and he just happened to die for it. That's, that's oh. so sad. Oh. Okay, Bands coming in from Beta here, and oh my gosh, what a set. What a, I, it's what a set, and it's one game in. Yeah, and I mean, like you're saying, like, if anyone else is playing Duck Hunt, or not, not Duck Hunt, playing Duck Hunt, you're like, not expecting it to be like, a quick pace, like, yeah. rush down type of match. Somehow he's able to play Ducka in a non campy way. I know. Like, it's crazy. <laughs> I don't know how he does it, but he plays Ducka incredibly hype. And of course, as I expected, Beta gonna go right back to that Mario. The DDD in this matchup, you know, not good. Beta <laughs> shakes his head as soon as I say DDD. <laughs> And it looks like we're going to Smashville here. If it's if it's a best of five, uh, and he wins two games, then we might convince him to go DDD game three. Okay. But uh, otherwise, I yeah, it's it's not gonna we're not gonna be seeing DDD in this matchup. Okay. We're and looking like a good start for Doc Hunt here. Oh yeah, this is definitely seems did, less beta favored this game. Did, did I see that right? Did he get hit by the reticle of the? can but not the can itself yeah that it, is so unfortunate i know it has that little hitbox and it usually doesn't come into play but it did there like it's just like the fact that the can was right oh, that's the, oh, okay the okay so good good save on the di there oh my like God. He, de he definitely could have died there if he didn't yeah. di it correctly Bart's coming in. Was that Mare that said that yeah. oh, oh my gosh okay good yeah. jump call out right there We've got a we've got a good start here for Duck Hunt. Uh, it's gonna be, oh that was just a, a yeah. good frame trap. That's the thing. Even with that air dodge, you know, saves you from that first one, but then Mario can just come right down with that second one. And that back air is so fast, you're getting multiple dose. Yeah. Why yeah. don't? I have to wonder. Bye bye. Okay. Goodbye, my fellow commentator. It's me, a lone man on the mic. But it's okay. We chill. 
he yeah i'm just like this is very close and could go either direction uh-oh this is not where you want to be <laughs> oh, there's some Mario. gaming happening over here there is some gaming happening it is Who's it is gaming the gaming is uh I mean, we had beta win last match, right? But it's it's been pretty pretty tight, uh, both for both players. Uh, very close match last time, and as you can see, the percents were even. <laughs> they and they could still be even in just a second, but like, yeah, it, they're they're scrapping very very well right now. I'm a little surprised to see beta play the Mario again. I mean, we were just talking about how done. we were talking about how DDD really hates this matchup. It is yes. awful for DDD, and so you know sometimes you gotta bring your old main out of retirement because your current one sometimes is gonna to... die in the trenches. Oh, that <laughs> nearly a, the same circumstance that happened at the end of game one, just a different move. Can instead of frisbee. Wow. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Amber alert, guys. Okay, I'm, I'm turning off my notifications in case Amber alert can come through. It hasn't come through yet. We're, we're about to see. Maybe. Huh? You said Amber alert. Where's the Amber alert? There we go. That's the real Amber Alert experience, buddy. <laughs> what happened? Uh, Amber Alert, uh... Or actually, no, it's not a... Okay, correction, it's not an Amber Alert. The child has been saved. Unfortunately, a snow squall is in its place. It's divine punishment for the person that one creep was about to steal the child for. And so God just had to say, nah, you can't get away with this snowstorm for eight hours. <laughs> okay. Uh, hold on, wait. It is not... Hold on, I gotta get... Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Why won't it... Hold on, wait, wait, wait. I, I'm not recording anything! Okay, here we go. Okay, we're good, we're good. Alright, we're in match. <laughs> We've got it back. Oh my gosh. Look at this. And he's trying to end him. He's going to get the drag down up air. The, the, the classic underdog tech. That up air barely hitting because of our sin. But that's just what the, the Phantom Thieves ordered. And what the heck. Gordo actually being very useful for once. I can't believe he weaved past both of those fairs. Yep, is very smart. <laughs> and we're going off. We're going super deep, but while that would kill a bunch of characters, this is DVD. The best character in the game. <laughs> People are afraid to admit he's S tier, that he's better than Joker, better than Mithra, better than Steve, for that matter. Just like, yeah. Look at this big man, this penguin buddy. How can you compete with this? Oh, see, look. First stock taken by the DDD. What does this mean? Better than Joker. It, it's just facts. Until Yep does something, in which case the, the stocks will, will fall again. But, you know, that, that's just how the stock market works. This is all just a uh, Sakurai's analogy for uh, stocks and bonds and trades and stuff like that. The backer will not kill at 176 because this is a big, a big penguin boy. And the, the Gordo lets him come back. Hector will not kill at 187. <laughs> oh boy. We now have a post 200 DVD. And we've got the, the splash screen Joker 
side B will kill on the, on the ground in a second. Okay. <laughs> All right. And hey, I mean, that's that's just what a DDD wants, right? He wants to extend his lead as far as he can and just get an advantage. And look at him. He's at 68 to 11. Perfect. Just what he always wanted. Oh. And I have uh, Monsieur uh, Stream Man coming over here to uh, mis fix my mistakes. I can't believe what! Look at these back airs. Look at these dares. Oh, look oh at my these bears! He's doing everything! Oh my goodness. I can't believe how good Beta makes his character look. Because every like everyone every everyone calls DDD like D tier, like bottom like ten for no reason. Beta himself has tweeted about this. I saw the tweet. He's like, "Do I need to go to more tournaments to prove that DDD isn't awful?" <laughs> but uh, like. Yeah, and it's just like, look, look at this man. Look at how crazy he goes. Oh my gosh. He lives? Okay. Alright, we got the back here. We got the little... Oh my gosh. That, that's, that really is the beta right there. Like, being in a, a stressful last stock situation, be like, I'm throwing this out, you won't see it coming. Kudos to Beta, only the, only the most uh, skilled or insane, and remember there's a fine line between insanity and genius, but uh, look at look at these up airs, I, I, think, I think we can tell which one Beta is until he dies to that. <laughs> see, and, and see this, this. <laughs> <laughs> see, see, th th this is how you make comedy. You you talk up one character or talk talk down one player or the other, and then once something happens, you're proven wrong. And and like, that's just that's just humor. Talk That's the Steve way though. Steve will make it happen. <laughs> uh, if hazards if hazards are off, Rinsor does not rotate. <laughs> no way. That is <laughs> I'm so ready. I am, I'm here to see the legendary Brinstar match. Okay, we're going to small battlefield, which is slightly more interesting than PS2, but not my much. All right, we've got here a nice little game two going. We've got some some Joker moments going on, some funny little up airs into up bees, and we've got 60%, and it's just it's just going. When will the penguin return? Oh my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> the, the best part about that option is that it's like everyone just freezes. They're like, I don't want to get hit by this. And either they make a mistake and get hit by it anyway, or they just are like running away. It's, it's just so funny. I feel like those options are more likely than actually just like strictly punishing it. It's, it's just very funny how that works. Down B just makes people afraid. 
This is an arson. He's coming in. And he can't get that. And Veda's still dead. Uh we had we had a good first first uh game here. Uh can Beta bring the sauce back? Or is the small battlefield just everything that's wrong with ultimate? <laughs> I'll be real, I thought that Arsene was gonna come out and Yepa's just gonna go for Dare without coming back to stage because he's just baller. <laughs> he made the right decision, but like, imagine how crazy it would have been, you know? And that's it. That's a, a funny move. Uh, but this is not over, right? We said best of five. So this is Beta's chance to reverse 3-0. <laughs> okay, actually, he has a different goal. He, he's he's not trying to he's not trying to win the set right now. He's trying to land Jet Hammer, and that will do the mental damage. That will be enough to help him get back in here. <laughs> Kudos to our our chatter Amara in the chat. <laughs> You are noticed. Sorry, we don't pay attention to chat as much as we as much as we should, but yes, not not most tournament streams. However, this is the Weaver State chat that has. <laughs> if if we can give Beta like, hey, do this in the highlights like a month into the future, <laughs> like I think we can. Call out our chatters like every hour or so. <laughs> oh my gosh! And he didn't make it back! He sacrificed himself for the sauce! Just like Persona 5, when you think about it. <laughs> and you know that we were out here. Fighting lies in the making. Can't move fast without breaking. If you hold on, life won't change, okay? I just need you all to know this. And that almost frame trapped the extension. What? Air dodge? And Beta's winning. What is this bait that Yep is going for? I, I appreciate it. I, I like to see people cook like that. It unfortunately didn't pay off, but like, what if? Arsene almost hurting him there because he couldn't react to the F throw. And this is the, looking like a fun time. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Beta almost getting his desired jet hammer to come back. And he gets up tilt instead. The, the silly little move. The silly little guys. The commentary. Uh, I would, uh, I mean, I would think that the smaller the better, because you're rushed down and he needs a little bit of space for that. <laughs> yep, yep, wanted me to uh, recommend some, some stages, uh, but he wants to run back. Uh, so, we will see how this goes. We'll, we'll see if he changes his mind if uh, Beta wins uh, this uh, fourth game. Okay, you've seen game four Leo. Have you seen game four Beta? I don't know if you have. So, uh, we're, we're about to unlock a new Chronicle in the Smash lore books. And, okay. For a second I thought he was gonna hold jab longer and it was about to even the percentages with like one jab. But it's not that good. I'm impressed with how much Beta has forced Yep to respect him off stage. Uh, because like several times he was running off stage to get stuff, and now like that whole last off stage interaction, he was just like, 
I gotta, I gotta be careful. I can't get fared and stage spiked, which is smart. It is adaption. It's just kudos to whoa, kudos <laughs> to Beta for making that work. Oh, and will he get the side B kill off the top? Not quite. Our son is almost out. Beta's going for Jet Hammer while our son is out. Our son almost killing Yep by disappearing at the the wrong moment, but uh, we are we are in here. We're mashing out, and uh, we've got an even game, buddy. <laughs> I don't know how that fair missed. I don't think there's an air guard. It just looked like it went straight through Joker. But, you know, that's, that's how this game works sometimes. Oh, boy. Can Arsene help this man? Oh, that back here. Okay. Getting the, the fair one into the up smash confirm. Pretty, pretty good Joker stuff going on. In my heart of hearts, I'm like waiting for someone to do like the craziest like mind games to the other player. Just like doing some like walk back and forth or like just the craziest like wait. What? He mashed out and the footstool did? What in the world? Okay. Beta's in a little bit of tough position. However, nothing that a little uh, jet hammer can't uh, fix, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, oh, but that is uh, no way he survived. He got away. Beta baiting out that fair. And oh my gosh, look at, look at, the, look at this. Look at the like, mind games going on right here. Half of our sin is gone. But it's still very much here, and that's it. Right. I turned the mic off by touching it. Ho ho hopefully, I was recording that whole- I'm pretty sure it was just a second ago. I, I think most of that was recording, so we should be good. <laughs> Is it time for Losers Round 1 to be played on stream? Yo! Okay.
talking, talking. So Hello. I was talking over with my homies, uh -huh. and I noticed, and I'm like, damn, nobody's on mic. And they're like, yeah, no one wants to be on this mic. You know it's gonna go to time. And I look, and it is Diara on the Robin against the 1K3 on the Snake. And the those I are two campers, however, However, Look at one, like, past 100 on the last star. Yeah, I mean, like, that's the thing. These are these are definitely campy characters, but these players don't play that campy. Why? I mean, I'd, I'd be inclined well, to disagree against, like, a certain one of these two. I don't know. They were, like, my round one, which I do want to say I did bring to last hit, which is a new, like, okay. best for me. Honestly, I might be insane, though, because I play Min Min. You have to approach against me. Yeah. Unless you're playing Sonic. <laughs> like. Yeah, so, like... In the event that these characters use special moves, the, and that's what's happening. True. And that's the game, and then it usually goes to timeout. However, e. Diamond Aura, crazy. Diara's crazy. What did I do? Also I will have Usker call you <laughs> mid set. I'll have him whisper sweet, sweet things no, in no, your no. ear. No, no, no. We get to a timeout. We're gonna get some really weird commentary. Remember, yeah. I think to talk about like, okay, I don't know. I'm really interested to see the Diara K rule. Yeah, I mean, like we got I, a, we got a whole plethora of K rule players here. I did not expect Ethan Diamondara to go the big K rule. I know, like, like out of anyone who would have like you know randomly pull out K rule, I was not expecting Diara. I mean, uh, maybe maybe a falcon, maybe a cloud. Okay, yeah. I, I was see expecting that. from the deep pockets. Um, we do have a lot of croc players here at the Weaver mm -hmm. State, so maybe it's just what's popular right now. Yeah. Maybe he's just the, going with the, the, the flow. The croc is in. Yeah, the croc is in. The pack is back, but the croc is in. Yeah, true. True. I like croc. And uh, both of these players are being blown up by grenade. True. I, I love seeing this happens. little firework display going on. Um, we'll just see which one gets exploded first. I'm surprised that the up tilt didn't do it, considering the monst it's a monster tilt. Well, of course, you know, K rules heavy. That's Usually true. that's why Diora picked it. It was like, hey, you know, I'm going to get blown up every two seconds. Might so as well have some weight. If you talk with 1K3 about Snake and grenades, he'll say Snake is heavy. He likes those traits. Every single time mm -hmm. you get hit by a grenade, he goes... Uh, he gets hit by a grenade and he's like, I don't care. I like getting hit by grenades because I'm heavy. Um, some, a, cer a certain someone he's fighting might be heavier is, is my one inquiry. But he also might not be liking it. The matchup is unwinnable. Oh yeah, this is... The, this, the this matchup is, is unwinnable. Give up. God. That was that was sad. At least yeah. we're not going to see a timeout though, right? It's a really good high call out. Bare minimum. I oh, do that. he's so cool. The down air. He does Thanks. have the... C4 no, was on stage. Gone. That was amazing. But Diora took 1% though, and so was it really worth it? 1k3 definitely making a slow burn of all of these K rule stocks, but you saw, um, no, I didn't expect Diora to play K rule. Does that what? mean he can't? No. no. He ended 1k3's life within a matter of seconds. The Diora K rule goes crazy. The, you know, the counter right there going well for him. And yeah, gaming. I K couldn't say it better. Dial. And yeah, that's exactly right. Yeah, and yeah. And yeah. And yeah. Um, <laughs> perhaps, yes. Is it mayhaps. Um, consider the following, uh-huh. Yeah. Consider the following blunderbuss and... He didn't, he didn't. I don't know what that. He's, that was, <laughs> no mind one. 1K3 tricks. saying he was ready to die for that, being the one who pulled the trigger himself. So I don't know why, um, maybe, maybe the kill spark changed his mind. Maybe. Um, hey, how much does Snake like those trades in this matchup? Yeah, I mean, because that's the thing. K rule's quite a bit heavier than you. But, you know, you can also put K rule in the nap time. But when you don't get that roll read after nap time. Yeah. Anyways, did get the C4. C4 is okay, huge. C4 goes crazy. Uh, where was it? I didn't. I was, I was kind of cooking. I didn't even see where it was. Oh, that's 2 0. Guys, this... I completely missed the back. Uh, oh, my 2 0. 2 0. Good Whoop job. Dee -doo. Good job. 1K. Happy birthday to uh, Snake. Man. Yeah. That, that was the match. I'd um I disagree. I don't but, know but, how but, much. But, but, but that, that that was the, the That was the game. Part. Was that the set? No. It was not the but set. But cable. That's a, that's a very thing. Apparently Diora K rule goes crazy. I never knew that I needed Diora K rule in my life. Are you out of bracket yet? Yeah. 
Uh, Are you? Doc Hunt and Tokyo? Yeah. We play the same. So, so, so we went, uh... Once. We went 2-1. I won a game. Because our first game was Min Min Duck Hunt, obviously. Mine was Cole Yeoman, and I was 2-1. Mm -hmm. Or, yeah, I was 2-1 yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. So, favor. And then the second game is very funny, because he goes, oh, okay, I'm going to go switch to Sheik. Because, you know, Sheik destroys Min Min. I switched to Rosa and won. Nice. The, the, the Edge Rosa had a comeback. That's what I'm talking about. And then I lost. That's After I, my, my Sonic went against his Duck Hunt. But, hey. Yeah, I won the uh, Seth K. Rule, which is new. <laughs> that's, that's I struggle good. with K. Rules, which is huge. Um, and then I lost uh, every Sephiroth Hithra to an F smash that oh, I was back airing to cover. Yeah. I landed too fast and it didn't come out. I wasn't dead, Someone but then my hitbox didn't come out and then I died. And then he went Steve and I lost that. Steve. Yeah. Speaking of Steve, Prince HD versus 1K3 here. I think you mean bioluminescent. Oh, true. Bioluminescent. I I, I I went I went to put bio I went to put bio and I typed boy. boy. This is huge. Boy. Boy. You get here, boy. Boy. Um, is this what what is this round three round? Is this winner something? I don't know. I don't know. One second. I will pull up the bracket. We can do that. I will consult the bracket. Me when I consult the bracket. Losers round three. It is not. It's going to be a best of three. Boo. But wouldn't it be funny if we just made it a best of five anyways? Okay. Are they playing? You know what's even Did funnier? They're playing... We're, and oh. the game at hand. Oh no, Steve Snake. I'm gonna Steve go Snake. take a nap real quick. Punk shoe, me, yeah, me, 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 me. Is... Energy going on over here. I don't know, both of these players are like really good at their characters. Yeah. And in their own respect, hype. In in their own minds, they're cool. That's for certain. Mm -hmm. Um There's there's Huh? Oh curse bracket! Yeah. Curse oh shit. <laughs> Yeah. Um, in case you didn't hear Cyrus, uh, he's referring to the podcast episode that we just recorded. Make sure to check Weaver State Smashculation. It's a title work in progress. I, I feel like that should moment. be just the regular title. Um, make sure to, to check it out monthly. Um, yeah, we talk we talk about Smash Brothers. And uh, right now, make sure to check out the Weaver State Weekly. We talk about Smash Bros as we watch Smash Bros happening. Um, for example. Like blocks. F smash, F smash, minecart, grenade, grenade. And These are Mario. some fire bars. We yeah. need a, we need to hire a mixer. Honestly, beta, Dual. put this in the rap track. <laughs> put this in the rap track. <laughs> and I'll just I'll make this the opening song for yes. for Weber State Smashculation. Yeah. Okay, we're seeing grenades at ledge. We're seeing Prince not being shaken by them at all. He gets off well enough and is able to kill with the minecart center stage on the big heavy boy. You'll love to see it. Yeah. But do you though? Because it is Steve. But anyways, the Nikita coming in, not going to be hidden. Honestly, this is a pretty good game for Prince so far. Even though, you know, he's losing a little bit, never mind. <laughs> he's losing a little bit, uh, never so mind. He, he's go. losing a little bit, never. I, I, I was. You took the joke. I, you know, I was like, never mind, he got an up tilt. Uh -huh. See. Oh no, Steve's Robin. losing. Never oh, mind. No. Up there. Up there. Up tilt. Yeah. He's in disadvantage. Not anymore. Minecart. Hey, he, he just used that move. And he used Are you build. a prophet or something, yeah. Edge? The I. Prophet. Yeah. Add that to your resume. It's it's going in the resume. We're seeing uh 1K3 trying to thread the needle, the grenades through the blocks there. Um, Prince is just kind of enjoying his time, mining away. Um, like I don't bomb. know what he is to mine, but he'll mine it anyway. I, I got that. <laughs> I, just, I, I got that reference. Okay. Oh, it, he's gone? No? Yes? Maybe? No? I, uh, I'm surprised one three didn't die there. So I was expecting it. Bioluminous are really good when it comes to the creative mode offstage, but, uh, 1K3 blew up himself there. True. It wasn't even the timer. He just deliberately said, someone is on platform, I'm c 4 uh, Not realizing it was himself. Yeah. You know, Can't drown like... his demons. They know how to swim. I They're also kidding. know how to swim. 
That's a lie. That's... I never learned how. Really? Yeah, I don't, I don't know how to swim. So, I mean, you know, I've dated you... people that never learned to ride a bike. What? That's a sad one. Oh my god. Yeah. But you know what Steve knows how to ride? Mine parts. Yes. <laughs> you know what Steve that's how to ride this one up tilt into the next up tilt into the next one into the up air. Into the block. Into the block. Yeah. Um, but he's not gonna be able to block that C4. Was it C4 with a grenade? I don't know. It was, it, it was an explosion. Yep. It was an explosion that hit him. It sent him upwards. That's kind of what Snake does. I thought that uh, Minecraft Steve would have his experience with these explosions coming from a game that has creepers. True. Um, they 1K3 being a bit of a creeper here himself. Whoa! <laughs> Did he? And then okay. He's not gonna We've kill. had multiple jump scares of people dying to their own. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we were talking about swimming. Yeah, we were we were talking about swimming and look at Snake's dive. True. He had perfect form. I saw no splash whatsoever. See, I wouldn't know that because I don't know how to swim. That's true. Yeah. <laughs> First game going to 1K3 against Bioluminescent. See, that's what we'll do as an after smash activity. We're going to go teach you how to swim. Yeah. I'm going to throw you in a lake. I'm, I'm going to watch. <laughs> Looks like we're going to be seeing the Pithra Makes as an sense. answer. I, they do got the bigger sword. They yeah. They are the uh, most brain dead easy character in this game, and I stand by that. I disagree. Have you seen Random? No, your game de your game plan changes based on who you get. Yeah. Yeah. Pithra combos, then kills. True. That's that's literally it. I despise Pithra, and uh, I know that Bioluminescent does as well. But maybe 1K3 is just gonna hit him a little bit more. Let's find out. Maybe. We're seeing some nares. There's the Prince HD special. Sorry, you're, you're, we're not making it the Bioluminescent special. Uh, yeah. I don't know if you were hoping for that or whatever. Nah, it's the Prince HD special. Of course. Okay, there's, there's the, the back, back row. row. The Nikita. Really good tech to keep uh, keep alive there. And honestly, this game is looking a bit more even than I thought it was going to be. For some reason, I thought, uh, you know, Bio was going to fucking queen. Yeah. Um, something that I'm seeing is you really want to be getting away with those safe aerials on shield that uh, Mithra does. Mm -hmm. Grenade makes that really hard. True. Grenade makes that really rough. It, depending on your percentage, 1k3 is getting his up airs, his back airs, a lot of kill confirms off of you hitting him. And uh, Bioluminescence just got to play patient, which you can see them doing so proficiently. Just keeping the snake in the air. Uh, up tilt. Snake keeping the Pithra in the air yeah. with up tilt. So, so that up tilt, great kill option as we all know. 1k3 just showing it again and again and again how well he can kill with that. But of course, you know, Bio out here with a lot of percent on Snake right now, on 1k3. And, you know, can he secure the kill here? Is it going to take him a second? Probably, because, you know, explosions, grenades, Nikita, up smash. Yeah. Looking like a warfield. Uh, they don't have creeper experience yeah. anymore. True. Yeah real rough um if i played xenoblade at all i'd maybe make a reference here um unfortunately for you guys i'm not a dweeb <laughs> i played xenoblade one i never touched two as soon as, soon as they introduced rex i was like man i liked cool british guy not cringe british okay guy. almost died cooler. there into did die there True. really unfortunate true combo yeah. almost die into actual die there's the crazy. He isn't gonna get the landing hit box, but that's all right. I think he wanted there it. It is that time, dude. Sir <laughs> Snake's got monster moves. So does Pithra. It's like close to not okay. Close? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. You're you're very right about that. Thank you for keeping me in check. Yeah. I respect you. If I ever see your Pithra hate dwindling, I gotta make sure. <laughs> yeah. I'm a I'm a sleeper agent. My activation is something like a, a Pyra, Pipra, up, up play, you know. Oh, what? Was that, oh, uh, did that catch the jump? Yeah, that, 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 that's game, that's game. It's best of three. Cool. It's not, it, it's, it's not top eight. It's best of five. Oh, it's, it's best of five. Oh, it is top eight? Yeah. What we can't finish by nine? It's losers from yeah, all four of them. Oh, no, what, oh, oh yeah, okay. what if we don't finish by nine? What if we don't finish by nine? Okay, apparently it is best of five. It's best of five, guys. It is best news, of five. News to me. Larry? Oh. I, I was so, I the, was so the wanted the you Larry. See, this is the counter pick. Yeah, it is. Revenge Grenade. 1K3 is going to love this. But, but do you want to know what would be an even better counter pick? Larry. 
Really? I mean, I've always been more a Ludwig guy. Okay, you see, Ludwig is, I don't know, I like Lemmy. I, li I like him, he's goofy. Lemmy's he's good. 67%. Lemmy's good. I do give you Lemmy. I say that he's top four. Okay. Yeah. So you say, I like Lemmy, you know, I am a uh, Roy enjoyer. Roy's, cool. Roy's, Roy's, all, Roy's top three. So you say, Roy's cool, he has sunglasses. Very true. Uh, I'd go as far to say he's he's my top two. My uh, my number one is Ludwig. Mm -hmm. My other top favorite, Morton. Mort Morton's funny. Morton's funny. I like Morton. uh, see, as long as we aren't Iggy fans here, we're good. Thank you. I am an Iggy Everybody hater. Everybody loves Iggy. He's literally not cool. He's a nerd. He's literally not cool. He Don't is like the him. nerd emoji. Yeah. Iggy sucks. Like, if you're choosing Larry, you're basic, mm -hmm. right? At least if you're if you're not dumb for people that choose Iggy. Yeah. That caught the, the down smash. Really unfortunate scrap scenario. Yeah, the interaction of all time right there. That interaction <laughs> was... <laughs> Dash attack murders, though. Yeah. Can't be too upset. Really right, good okay. grab. Oh, yeah. Let's go to get off. Get a little percent off there for yeah bio. i was ready for maybe like a, a down kill into bringing up the ladder but nah he just called out the defensive option very very nice 1k3's snake super defensive in its own right he uh unless he's making a read based on a chase he's always staying just out of arm's length and doing his best to react with like unreactable first options and really good uh Grabs and chases answers to these. Good spot dodge there as well. Well, we missed so close to hitting one of these side Bs, but one kick three just remaining out of that burst range. Good up air to call out the jumping snake. And there's that dash attack. Not gonna dash kill this time. Off. Really oh good. My. That was, that, that was almost crazy. Almost crazy. Don't know if that was intentional. Beta, but we roll with don't it. put that in the highlights. It was not cool enough. But this might be it's not Snake gonna just throw off grenades. There's some good old ledge trapping, there's that down the smash. Down smash catches. Yeah. The thing is, again, like Incineroar definitely wins this matchup. I, I mean like Snake's a top tier, Incineroar is not. But Snake has or Incineroar has good counter snake options. That doesn't mean that they win. That just means I, nah, you got good they options. Win. So we'll see if Bioluminescence able to make this back. Mm -hmm. I mean, you can kill basically any time with Incineroar, especially with an up smash on Revenge right now. Yeah, I mean, 1K3 just trying to dart around those ranges. You're seeing him get desperate for a grab. Yeah, but he's not gonna get Instead. it. There's gonna armor through the Nikita. There's that down smash. Not gonna get anything. There's the jab. Bio off stage right here. 1K3 try to use those ledge traps. Really oh, weird interaction crazy. there. Took off the revenge as well. Puts him into nap time, kicks him, kicks him away. Yep. Looking 3-0, oh, 1k3. Yeah. Bioluminescent, taking seventh. <laughs> Every week it's Psyker and Psyker. The Psyker? So, you know... Average cursed bracket moment. Average cursed bracket moment. Hey, you guys should check out the podcast whenever I find that. a way to get it up. It's going to be very cool. Yeah. You're going to be seeing in the highlights, hopefully, a uh, current SD, SD counter. counter. Yeah, we have some, we have some bets. One second. You guys know it's crazy. When it comes to monthly bets that we got going on, I wanted to figure out how many times we thought we were going to see an SD on stream. <laughs> Guess who thinks the most SDs are going to happen on stream? Edge. 32 SD for the month of January. It's gonna happen. 32. Okay, okay, okay. The thing is, that's we have both Yep that's, and that's Cyrus on stream. Kakarot went lowest with 19 SDs on stream for the month of January. I put 23, Cyrus with 29. And you're just crazy. I, I, I'm you're, just gonna happen. You're clinically insane. No, watch. It's going to happen. I mean, we got, we got pride on the line here. Yeah. You know. So you say if I lose, I'll I won't play Min Min for an entire tournament. Um I don't think that's I mean the one thing that won against uh Doc Hunt for you was the Rosa, right? It was the Rosa. It was yeah. the Rosa. 
No. Yeah. We were so close to taking both of our games, and then we would have matched into each other. That would have been funny. So someone broke the setup. What is this thing? What? <laughs> There's your problem. Well, don't, don't we have first party adapters? Somebody the, got the, the knockoff bag? adapter. Cyrus, can you get us a first party power cord? First party power cord? First party power cord? Like AC adapter. Bag? Like switch power cord? Like you plug it into the wall, you know? Yeah. You know, the one that's cubular. Not, yeah, not all whatever this, this is. Do we not have one? <laughs> all I know is that whatever this is, is. Okay. It, yeah. I don't know who broke the setup. Oh, I found one. It was probably boat. I can see boat. It was probably boatable. Yeah. 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 Somebody bought, you know, the Amazon great deals. So where's unplug the? It's the box. It's this one. Yes. Wow. Okay. At least it's a knockoff that's actually a box. If it's not, that'd be crazy. Nothing's breaking? Okay. Uh, I was just waiting for the, you know, the right. computer to just shut off. Yeah. I'm ready for, um, for oh, the was... Alamo to be forgotten. Oh, true. I'm never ready for the day that the Alamo gets forgotten. Okay. I pressed the button. So we shouldn't have a line. I think it's working. Maybe. It should be working. No. Okay, we're set. Okay, we're good. But we have names to change. This isn't bioluminescent in 1K3. This is Yep and Easy a Classic. That I, I haven't seen in a while, but this is a fun match. Anytime these two meet up with Dude, each other. Dude, whenever Easy drops by, you know you got good sets going. And oh, yeah. I saw him going Greninja oh, my against... God. That's what I'm saying. I saw him Hello. going Greninja against Cyrus. It's the Red Frog. He's literally Ash Ketchum in the way that he's doing the, you know, the Soulbind thing, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ash Greninja. Easy yeah. Greninja. Easy Greninja. That's true. Oh That's true. It's yeah. Ash Greninja. Ash is literally. Oh. <laughs> All right. Looks like we're going to PS2. You know, classic commentators, Joe Kaha, home field advantage. Oh my God. I'm so funny, guys. <laughs> You don't yeah. know what isn't funny? These up airs. And I mean, how much pressure. <laughs> <laughs> My man's playing Joker and he's getting hit with the thing that the Joker does against the other people, but on Greninja, but against the Joker. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? What he said. <laughs> I'm just botching stuff to have fun with it. I've already talked for an hour straight oh, yeah. today. You did too. But that does not change that what's happening is worthy of the best commentary, so we're doing our best out here. You're seeing down air almost had the tech read. Oh, but there's a polar star gonna kill! Wow, so hype. We love Greninja, we love frogs, and we love, I don't know, androgynous we men. We love Ash Ketchum. Yeah, we love Ash Ketchum. We love Ash Ketchum. I was talking about Joker, but like, I don't know. Is, is Ash Ketchum androgynous? Okay. <laughs> you see, I'm, I'm ready for Easy to take a stock any second now. Uh, my proof, he's hitting Greninja dash attack. He is. That's the thing he wants as Greninja, and he's hitting it. We're just waiting to see a conversion. Oh, but there's the down air coming out from Yep. It's not going to do really anything, nice but it's coming out. The, the pizza toss doesn't do it just yet. <laughs> Going for a low down air, but... Great parry in the back. Ooh. Still not going to kill... Yep, live it at one. Okay, now nope, And gone. there's the back air. This time he gets the read going low underneath the ledge. Really nice chase for easy. Get yeah. the first stock. There's the Greninja dash attack. So infamous. There's another one, but we're able to answer with a back air trade. And the thing is, he's hitting all these dash attacks, but he's not getting anything from them, you know? So yeah. it's like, womp womp, you're not gonna you're not gonna kill. Boy, do I got the person to hit up. My butt Lagoon. Legume? Boy, does he got some tips for yeah. you. Well, like, Legume would have never gotten hit by that up smash. Not Fun fact, Legume is French for the goom. <laughs> true. And you know who else is French? Greninja. That's true. Yeah. I think. I never played X and Y. Mans is actually LaFrog. For real. True. That's, that's what Greninja a, translates into. That's Oh, he went too low oh, that time. You hate to see it. Yep, trying to cover the recovery with a down air, but... 
Uh, not needed. The Greninja just wanted the blast zone. He got lucky. See, does that count as an SD for me? I, I think that does. Okay, let's go. I think that does. Oh, he no! footstooled. He footstooled. Right here and now. Roll it back. Not an SD. I'm crying. Greninja is friend. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Good back air oh! drag down. That was crazy. That was crazy. All right. Aw. Oh, there's the forward tilts coming in. Just a really good little, you know, range poke move. And there's dash attacks okay. coming in. Back dash air. attack back air is really, really nice. Especially since you were able to carry it off. Who cares that you're getting not your that you're not getting hits one and two? Mm -hmm. Your job is to get them off stage. And uh, you have a pretty good nair to answer to tether recovery as well. And um Great parry there. Straight into the forward smash. smash. There's an air coming up. Ooh, great air dodge there. There's the back Love air. the down tilt. Mm -hmm. Catching a lot of oh, yeah. Yep's defensive options coming out of the air here because, well, Greninja likes to juggle, so. He does. That's his thing. Really good on easy recognizing these scenarios, but, but up smash. it's not going to matter. Our set up smash. Yeah. And again, if this was Legute, no. So you see. Oh, real, real quick, real quick. Is this winner's quarters? This winner's semis? Is it? This is winner. This, this is winner's, winner's final. final. Wow. Okay, we're seeing the easy Greninja still and the Yep Joker still. Yeah, I just have to find it. There it is. I'm so awesome. And then we're gonna hit the four key. Yep. <laughs> okay. I can't wait for that one to pick up on the stream. Do you think it will? I don't know. We were talking about that on the you... podcast, which everyone here should listen to. By the way, yeah. <laughs> you know it's a hot clip when the mic is picking up Kakarot's atomic lap in the background. True. Sadly, not here this time around, <laughs> yeah. but the energy still present. But you know what he is here for? The podcast. Which and you can... he's here in the comments, True. too. In chat. In number chat, one chatter. So... And number one back air there coming out from Yep, that R set back air. And there's a forward smash yep too. Yep has been take hitting that these forward smashes oh, this yeah. set. Yeah, parry, <laughs> parry forward smash to, on, on the rapid jab. Oh, true. Yeah. It yeah. Really, it was hype. We mentioned it. So <laughs> <laughs> Nobody does it like him. He presses the kill move and kills. Whoa. See, I could never do that. Do you know who could? Like you. <laughs> <laughs> the Goom for you American oh, yeah, yeah, speakers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Something for Easy Sports. Spy is commentator. Easy's forward smash was so good, it was almost on the level of legumes. It's crazy. Well, I mean, Greninja's thing is up smash out of down yeah. tilts. Wow, are we being right. biased over here? Yeah. I don't know if you know this, but Easy actually kicked my dog. <laughs> 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 I can't believe Easy would do that. Do you know who wouldn't do that? Like you. Legume. Legume would never kick dogs. Yeah. All right, there's a dash attack coming out from Easy. Not gonna get anything off it. Another Easy back air get hit air. from Yep. Oh, really unfortunate. Just I shy of that cheer. leg. Never mind. I oh, see. The issue is now with the SD counter, I'm trying to cheer for SDs. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. I win a something. There's a, another aim for the forward smash. Easy just drifting a little too far out of ledge there. Gonna make it back to ledge this time, and that's really good. Nice grab. Ooh. Trying to get some uh, conversions off the grab. Greninja having a hard time to do that. Your grabs are really good. I don't think you have too much out of grab, though. Yeah. But you do have that monster pivot grab, so. It well doesn't really matter. You're fishing for positioning in this. Honestly, right now, you should be fishing for a kill with that down smash, but of course, you have gonna. I know, we see Yep fishing for our ascent with really good Rebels guards. Oh, yeah. Trying to get a second one out of this stock. We'll see if one comes out before Easy's able to take the stock. We have seen that he's been struggling to get a lot of kills here, like a, a multi hit not working. However, oh, that back gonna hit. Easy never fails to miss those chases deep off stage. <laughs> he never fails. What, is that what I said? Yeah, wow. I, I'm a. Uh, I'm <laughs> I can't believe my co commentator never, would be he never misses those. I would never. He never misses those. Yep. Sorry, that's a that's a double negative. And which a... results in being twice as negative. It never cancels out. I agree. I don't know. I failed math. Yeah. 
I don't know numbers. I can't count. I can't swim. I can't count. I'm a special person. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Pokemon Stadium 2 again. Man, I absolutely love stage diversity yep. and having as many stages as we do in the Dude, game. It's crazy to me that spectators and commentators are like, why does everyone play on PS2? I want to see more variety. Three, like, hey, do you have to play on the only main stage? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. No. Except sometimes Battlefield, but like Mario's in the game. And this is why we need to legalize Mario Maker. Yeah, yeah. You see... Health is not as much of a problem as you think. It's smirking. Yeah, see? Like we were talking about on the podcast. Yeah, true. Whichever one should listen to as soon as it's up. We don't know when it's going to be, but as soon as it's up. You see, it's not a shameless plug because I'm very proud of the, yeah. <laughs> of, the of the podcast. It's a prideful plug. Okay. Throws. <laughs> Back air. Side beat. That is what's happening. A good parry there, but no forward smash coming out of it. Yeah. You know who does do that? Not with Yume, but yeah. I'm seeing a lot of close quarters here. Nobody's mm -hmm. really picking any options that uh, favor these long ranges. You're seeing Yep occasionally trying to snipe out um, disadvantage He's so options cool. with side B, but these players are always running out and then right back in, yeah. trying to feign out all of these swats and then right back to hitting with those that's super close too. boxy. Um, Nice back air offset. Yeah. So many back airs have been uh, resulting in the yep stars. And the thing is, this game, well, these characters kind of want to, you know, get in each other's faces a lot here. And so we get a bunch of scrap after scrap after scrap, whether that be on stage, on ledge, or off stage. We're always getting some sort of scrap, some sort of close range. Oh, I'm going to hit you as hard as I can. For sure. I mean, Joker, definitely a lot more of a, of a big brain character to pilot in these. He's got a lot of uh, niche positioning to work around. Uh, Yep's never used gun in his life, so scrap, <laughs> take everything I said and throw it out the window. That being said, it's not too uh, dissimilar from the way that the Greninja plays. I'm surprised that dash attack didn't kill. Yeah, honestly, I wasn't going to go special with the Arson. Nair coming out, and that's not even going to kill. Easy living as Greninja at 178, something that you wouldn't do. We might be seeing the improvement here on easy side. All right, there's the dentist trying to come out for some sort of two frame, trying to catch him, hang on. There's to the down throw, something. but he was ready. Mm -hmm. 187 as Greninja. This is actually kind of crazy. And of course, easy is living. Yeah. And the thing is, Yep lost the big funny top hat man, and so it's gonna be harder to kill as well. I don't think so. The moves that we're gonna kill are still gonna kill. Nuh-uh. Not anymore. <laughs> no. -uh. <laughs> no. -uh. That's a good argument you got there. Really anyway. good parries, and there's oh the Greninja. He did a Greninja he thing, did a Greninja guys. Thing. Hey, Legume, check that out. Greninja oh. thing. Legume, put that in the VOD review. <laughs> Legume, put that in your brain. Legume, write that down. <laughs> Okay, for the first time in the set, we're seeing a solid stock lead for Easy here. Yeah. Yep's gonna have to claw his way back to uh, to a solid position where he's able to kind of be more passive. But in the current moment, we're seeing just under four minutes left in the game. Both of these characters are very fast in their own rights. Um, if Easy wanted to, he could be hard to chase at a moment's notice. Let's do the Easy timeout. <laughs> yeah. Let's do the Easy timeout. I, I, I don't think we will, which is, is a good thing for us. If that is Yep good. ends up taking the set from this game, then uh, the results might say something else. But yeah. I'm going to see the Yep timeout when he's a stock behind. Really good back here. Ooh, he oh, knew oh. the Rebels Guard was coming, yeah. but he was just a little too shy. So you're trying to hit a lot of these back airs. We really want to get this kill here. Doing really good just dashing back and forth, trying to get those downhills. There's the Mikleo. Oh, but he survives it. Coming here, another death check out of whip. Ooh, oh, great jab. The tomahawk up smash is gonna get greatly answered to by that fast option out of shield. Here's the back door, still not gonna kill. Greninja at basically 140 here, 138. Dude, Easy's. I, I think we owe, Easy owes his uh, game if he takes it. Of course, I don't wanna say anything too early. <laughs> He has his game to the survivability that he's had, doing oh, yeah. really good at avoiding those Joker kill options that are just so potent for the entire game, so safe. Um, he knows his way around this threat range, but let's see if he's able to know his way around the kill zone with Arsene out. 
yeah, a no. lot of stuff that Yep can get here is gonna murder. If he lands a down air, um, I say Easy's as good as dead. Yeah. So they're and still dying to a single hit you here. You up so much percent so fast when you have that percent. There's a reason why it's like the comeback mechanic. And there's the up smash. There's the up smash. No! <laughs> I, I cursed it. Yeah. I, I cursed it. I should shut my fat mouth. Commentators right curse. Right now. But so, good set. But is that Beta and Cyrus I see coming to the setup? Yo, Beta Ray Cyrus. Oh. Yeah, well, it's, it's a nice highlight. I'll just say it five times so you don't miss it. Yeah. Beta Ray Cyrus. Beta, Beta Ray Cyrus. Beta, put that on the highlights. Beta Ray Cyrus. Oh. Wow. This is so cool. It's almost as cool as Beta Ray Cyrus. Beta Ray Cyrus. White screen, ow. One second. This is Losers Semis. Very cool. That's like my whole personality. I know how to do stuff. I don't. I press buttons from time to time. <laughs> they don't let me press buttons. Casual button enjoyer. Average shortcut fan. Oh, they're playing. They're, dude, this is so bad. So a and straight wait. Uh huh. <laughs> wow, guys, this is such good gameplay. Don't you agree? So actually, I'm um, peeking over a little bit. Beta's at 72. Cyrus is at 58. Cyrus is playing Sheik. Beta's on that classic King Dedede. The ledge trapping scenario for Cyrus here. This really hurts my neck. Beta's a <laughs> whole pass of ledge trap. Has that in there. Cyrus stuck in the air. Hmm. Trying to get okay, there's the Gordo. It's hidden. Gordo, there's a the hammer, but it's not gonna hit. Oh, the Gordo's gonna hit Cyrus. Can't Cyrus recover there's dash attack, but it's not gonna hit. You know, gonna needle this him. lack of visuals really reminds me of a certain artistic style that like has just podcast. been honest, like a podcast. Do you know who's in that podcast? Cyrus. And he's playing right now. And What's Cyrus aiming. doing, Edge? Uh, he is on ledge, hitting Beta with a dash attack, which sends Beta into the air. And he's gonna nair on Beta's shield, but Beta's gonna roll out of it. There's the needles coming in, but Beta's Does anyone know the Spike is three more? What? Is that the one with the Elijah Wolf? Yeah. <laughs> that is. I got confused. That's the one where the Beta quote, like, do you think God stays in heaven because he too fears what he created? The Spike, <laughs> spike is three. That Spike is three. Let's go. Yeah, that has the thumb guys, too. No, that's Spike it's two. Is that two? Two has three. the thumb Which guys. One is the one? I don't know my Spike. Where one has the thumb gets people, the gorilla the island. island. Gorilla Spider. Is that the end of one? Because like they have. No wait, little... no wait. Gorilla Spider's two. Thumb Thumbs is one. Yeah. Well, because they have the little pet, and then the pet gets freaking nuked, right? Yeah, yeah that's, that's two. <laughs> that's two. I wonder why. This and then three is the crazy 3D CGI mess that <laughs> I love to no end. Yeah, <laughs> the best movie of all time. The only thing I watched yeah. that at my neighbor's house when I was really little, and I don't remember a Same. single thing except he wakes up at the like on the moon, and then he's like, "It's been three days," and then the computer goes, "Time flies when you're playing a game." <laughs> And you see what I remember is the dude, and he goes, the "I'm the guy." That's what I remember. <laughs> that's uh, Elijah Wood. Name? Elijah Wood. The, no, that, that is Elijah Wood. Wood. Oh our, my God! Uh, uh, by I'm waiting for them to finish so I can fix it. I don't know, bro. <laughs> Cyrus, win already or my beta? Technical term of I either one works. <laughs> Bodable, what'd you do? I can't believe Bodable broke stream, and Beta's trying to break Cyrus's head with that dash attack, but can't hit it. Cyrus coming out here. There's that no. upbeat going crazy. The forwarders coming out there. So bouncing fish that doesn't hit anybody. Explodes beta. We love explosions. We love beta slowly falling back to ledge. All right. Cyrus has him on ledge. Try your going for that suck. Gonna suck up nothing. Has him on ledge. There's the up air. I really hope like this is like Smash Brothers ASMR. <laughs> ASMR with edge. It's not good. So we'll play telephone. You tell me what's happening as you watch. You whisper in my ear, and then I'll ASMR it into the microphone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I actually hate ASMR. Like, really? I, I it hate is it. the worst. It, it makes my, it makes my like little sensory processing autism ears hurt. See, my it problem is ee. every time I listen to ASMR, it triggers like my fight or flight response. Like I don't know what to do. <laughs> so, see, I just every hate single it. time I hear someone go, "Hello," I punch the nearest guy. <laughs> You know, I don't know, punch my monitor. You know, see, the they scrape their nails against hurts. the mic, and I just can't help but kick a child. I can't. Help. I think they're a threat. Yeah. yeah. I was actually going to say Gordo really diagonal. Who was it that was kicking dogs? It's easy. Not one Gordo. I hate. 
All right, match is I over. Ass. Match is right. over. One second. It's a best of one. Double. Hudson has to pick. <laughs> Oh, I still need a doubles teammate. I fixed it. You did it. You fixed it. We are so like bad. Who won? Who won? Beta won, right? Beta. Well, did you know how I'm not going to be commentating until 9? I'll, I'll do doubles for once. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, everything's good. We're good. We're good. I can, I can finally see that Cyrus is Spy Kids 3. I finally understand why you guys are talking about that. Wait, which one has Machete? Like the that first one. Because he's canonically Machete from Machete. Uncle Machete and Harris will give him all the time. Yeah. Can, can I, uh, you know, come that come out? Is this a safe space? Uh, I've never seen Spy Kids, any of them. Really? Get out. Uh, uh, this, this isn't a safe Listen, space. Listen, <laughs> I've seen Spy Kids 4 in 4D. They Whoa. gave you a scratch and sniff card at the theater, and like, you know, the poopy diaper would come on screen, and then the number like four would flash, and it's like, scratch sniff number four. And I'm like, no, I'm not doing that. And then I hear the entire theater go, Oh, and I'm like, what'd you expect? <laughs> you know what? I expect not that Gordo hitting fire. You know, I expect back air. Ba wow. That killed. You'll never believe what I was going to say. I expect you were going to say to live because he's heavy. Oh, I thought you were going to say something about scratch and sniff so you could smell CSS's back air hitting DVD and killing. What does that smell like? What do you think? <laughs> oh man, I'm, I'm gonna refrain from saying something that popped in the head for, I think, legal reasons. I don't know. Maybe it's human decency. Okay, yeah. the joke wasn't very funny. The joke is <laughs> <laughs> You guys didn't miss out on much. You guys didn't miss out on much. Yeah. <laughs> we have the Koliomin Col confirmation. You know what else we have a confirmation of? Beta killing with Nair. Taking the stock on Cyrus there. Trying to even up her sets here with some of those classic little DDD combos. DDD combos, they're all like two or three hits. We love our two pieces. Yeah. Really good forward air one to bear there. Really solid play from Cyrus. Don't know if there was a way out of that, if that was true. Uh, if I see something on ZSS, I just expect it to be really good on the ZSS player's part. So, you know. Jahammer! He just reacts. He just reacts to the Gordo hit. Yeah. That's amazing. See, Beta is so cool. There's a reason he's the people's champion. Me when Beta up throw up air. Yeah. So true, bestie. So true, bestie. Yeah. There's some juggles coming in from Cyrus. The upper is definitely not, not killed kill. us yet. It, it is DDD. I don't know what I was expecting. He's, He's trying to use those boy. back airs. Those scratch and stiff back airs. Not going to work, though. There's that down tail coming out. Gordo sending out a wonky angle. Not going to send Cyrus anyway, though, because it's not going to hit him. There's the get up attack. We're Gaming. seeing a lot of just scrap options, and we think it's going to work, and then it's just like two hits of forward tilt, and then he falls out. Well, I mean, that's what happens when you have two low tiers on Oh, there's the down smash. There's the side switch. Not, Not gonna, gonna kill. kill. No. Really? Big old fat penguin. There's that Gordo. I expected that down smash to hit, if I'm gonna be 100% honest, but Beta's just doing so good at fainting around the threat range of ZSS here. And there's the down tilt to take it. What? Uh, I'm not a Tom. Um, I'm glad you stayed for singles. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I'm glad you stayed. I couldn't agree more. See, see, the cool thing about DDD, right, is that he's a penguin, uh, but he can hey, fly. Listen, you should refer to the Wikipedia page. <laughs> King DDD like. is a gluttonous creature that resembles a penguin. It's never said outright. Nintendo, hire me. I can. Yeah. Club Penguin. Club DDD. Dude, I miss Club Penguin. Club Penguin. Dude, no, see, you see, I was an Animal Jam boy. I was both.
there's that scratch and sniff back here coming out again. Not gonna work. Also, how do we think the oh, ult change is affecting Cyrus's gameplay right now? Um, red. Red? Is he like only it seeing red? Oh. oh, gonna fall out. Classic low tier moment. The backer is gonna beat out the inhale though. Oh, the star gonna shield poke a little bit right there. Oh, from the top rope. Oh. When this game's, <laughs> he's he's like our mom. He says one more game, okay? <laughs> we can't pause it. It's live. <laughs> mom, it's online. <laughs> Mom, it's live on Weaver State. Wow, ZSS Is ZSS worse than Dedity? Yes. That's, that's what I'm seeing. <laughs> that Dedity is awful. I mean, the numbers don't lie, and yeah. they spelled disaster for ZSS. Plus two, plus two. Plus two matchup for Dedity? No, I mean, no. plus two as in I agree. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh seven. Oh seven. Oh seven. Mom said. Yeah. All right. There's the up tilt coming in from Cyrus. Uh oh. Mom says you can return the plane. Mom said we can share. <laughs> funny Gordo. We do love funny Gordo. Funny, you're up tilt. Classic beta moment. Classic DDD moment. There's a reason why DDD's, you know, top tier. That's very true. Compared to ZSS, at least. Do you know where else we talked about ZSS sucking? The, oh, podcast. the podcast! Wow! <laughs> Je I'm sorry, I was too distracted by firework carry by yours truly. See, I do love me some Katy Perry. I Okay. Uh, We're playing doubles. We're playing bubbles. Okay, mom. Okay, mom. Okay.
I'm here to watch some gaming. It's gaming time. Got here just to watch my gut win game one. We're here. We're at, we're at PS2 only. We've made it. That's how you know we're in the finals. Easy. How long have you been playing Greninja? I don't know what Greninja does. That's the character where I'm like, I don't know what they do. I feel like I know what every character does, kind of. I don't know what Greninja does. Game number two starting off a little bit better for easy. Not entirely sure how good Greninja is at killing. But there's the first stock for easy. A little bit too bad for Beta. He tried to throw out the Gordo, but he got hit. Him and the Gordo both got hit. Easy, able to recover. Beta trying to cheese him under the stage with the sock. Nice read from Beta with the jump rock hammer. Still not going super great for Beta at 82%. Easy, only at 11. Beta just kind of stuck off the right side of the screen for a lot of this game. That was odd looking. Two to one now in Easy's favor. Oh, that killed. Beta basically evening out the game, both players starting at uh, the last stock 0%. Beta going really strong in this last stock right now. For most of this game, he's been kind of behind, but he has a pretty good lead right now. Easy getting some decent damage in. Ooh, Beta dies there. Beta trying to cheat there and pick a banned stage. So he has to go to the second best thing. Uh, the last game was pretty in favor of Easy throughout all of it until like the final stock where Beta was able to get like some really good percent lead. But Easy was able to actually win. Kind of happening again. Easy has a pretty good percent lead again. Mm -hmm. 
was waiting to see if someone died there, but they didn't. A little surprising on that off the top. Easy stuck off the stage. Is he still alive? Hanging on 134. Is he back onto the stage? Beta gets stuck number one at 144%. So it's possible Easy comes back and just kills him. Not quite yet. Beta actually getting some decent percent onto Easy before dying. If he does die right now. <laughs> Easy kind of stuck off the stage. Can't get back on right now. Finally gets back on. Beta gets another stock, 3 to 1 now, in Beta's favor, 177%. Beta finally dies. 195 when he finally uh, died. Game is pretty in favor of Beta right now. Being a stock up and percent up right now, or easy's percent up. Beta off the stage, Back. I had to go report some scores. Beta 184% hanging on. 196. Can Beta get to 200% before he dies? There's 201. The grab throw finally gets it pretty easy. So it's 1 to 1 now. Easy. It is 128%. Though, so it's. Pretty disadvantaged for him. There's game number three for Beta. Going to game number four. One, two, beta's lead right now.
Really good uh, giant hammer from Beta. He was kind of standing there waiting. Easy just went for the neutral get up and got hit. And got got. Anyways, frog and penguin-like creature out here. Jet Hammer going crazy, trying to get a kill here. There's the Gordo setup, dash attack, crazy moves. I'm busy, my voice hurts. I'm screaming from doubles. All right, Gordo, Beta's an entire stock ahead here. And he is a really high percent. Can easy secure kill here? No, he cannot, because he's getting hit by Gordo, almost killing him. Not quite though, makes sense. Easy's got that great DI as we saw a lot in that Yep game. Oh, but can't DI that down till that's gonna take the stock beta. Two stocks ahead, but there's a forward air clap back from Easy. Beta's still a stock ahead, but Easy could easily make this back. It's the thing, DDD, big heavy guy, and you know what Greninja likes? Comboing. So like, you know, match made in heaven. All right, but there's that stuck coming out. Forward everything. Forward set setup. Yeah, hammer, being ready. Beta's take a percent for it. That's how you know it's gonna be a big one. He, he's ready, <laughs> but then he gets sent by the little tiny Greninja Shuriken. There's the jabs coming out. Easy, just trying to rack up some damage here because it's the thing. You just want to kind of play it safe right here. You don't want to, you know, all of a sudden get hit by a gigantic DD jet hammer. There's that. Is, he up, is that gonna kill? Yes, it does. Beta's gonna take that 3 1 here. I don't know what happened to Bracket. Someone <laughs> close the tab. <laughs> I don't know who's next. It's someone, alright. Yeah. You know, so, you know. Yeah. <laughs> I hope someone gives one to you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So, looks like hands drifting into the corner here. No. Pretty hype gameplay here. Yeah. Again, every time I see this stage selection, it's like, man, we really do only play on like seven of these. <laughs> on legalized, legalized Mario Maker. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like the balloon. <laughs> yep. Yeah, moving platform is nice, but like balloon. Pirate shit? Exactly. Yeah, I'm waiting for pirate shit. You know, town and city with the balloon stage hazards on. Mario Circuit would be sick. You can go through like the bottom of it. When are we getting gamer? Hackland? Legalize? Style Mountain School. Minecraft World. Minecraft World would be crazy. No, never. Midgar. Yeah, Hazard's on. So yeah, you get like the one guy from the Final Fantasy game. I, I don't know. I didn't play it. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> oh, the other player's here. I still don't know what round it is or anything that's going on, really. All right, looks like Beta versus Yep here. Classic matchup. All right. 
Dedede versus Joker here. Hype combos, hype gameplay possibly, maybe? Jet Hammer, Arsene, Waddle D. Alright. Beta gonna start the game off with that Gordo. And it's instantly. Game's looking his favor, just gonna rack up a bunch of damage. In the up air hitting no one. It's not coming in, but the thing is, you know, Yep can thread that needle a little bit with that Joker. There's the Nair coming in. Has Beta on ledge. Dash attack, not gonna be hitting anybody. There's that back here though. Is there gonna be another one? No. I lied. Hudson's here. Is this Grands? I have no idea. It's probably. Okay, apparently this is Grands. I didn't know. Gordo's on ledge. That's crazy. Back throw coming. And there's the up air gonna catch. Yep. I take that stop. Joker screams into the distance. Beta at almost an even hundred. And there's instantly catch him. Tons of up airs coming out from Beta. There's that Gordo Knight. I would say I was hoping for the up spike. It's not gonna come out. There's the Gordos coming out though. Classic beta gameplay. And beta's basically an enti just st entire stock ahead here. Can you take a stock? He can. Good forward air. Good job. And there's coming out. There's the dash attack coming in. Fun fact, he does that dash attack in Persona 5. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, well, the data gonna be able to take that stock with that up there. Again, just still an entire stock ahead here. We're really gonna be pushing that lead with these combos. But of course, Joker combos are a lot cooler because they're more than like two hits. And they do more damage too, sometimes. All right, there's the four airs coming in. Gordo gotta drop down, but you know, you have gonna avoid it with that R set up B. All right, there's the back airs coming out. Is he gonna be able to take the stock here? Beta is off the ledge. No, can't get a good ledge trap here. Catch him with that dash attack from Persona 5. There's the side beat. I'm gonna <laughs> up smash Gordo. All right, but Gordo gonna hit both hits with that side beat. There's the border coming in, swing it. There's the Gordo snipe. That takes it. Beta wins game one here. No, that's a... Good, good game, good game, Gordo. <laughs> All right, looks like we're gonna keep going here with that DDD Joker matchup. Looks like comments are gonna start off from Yep here. Uses the grappling hook. That's from Persona 5 Royal. <laughs> I've played Persona. Yeah, no, if I had a nickel for every time a top Weaver player picked up Joker. So true, Popper. Let's see, Gordo's on ledge. Pivot grab, not gonna be grabbing anybody there. That was that was awful. Why does DDD's pivot grab look like that? Okay, but there's the falling nares. He's nearing, he's gaming. Full focus. But back air. I knew it. I'm the pro I'm 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 the Smash Brothers prophet. Good dash attack there. A footstool, but you know, it's DDD, so he just, you know, shoots right back up. Spike, uh, it scared him. But hey, we we count that as an SD. Beta put up the SD counter, because that's right. We're getting closer to 32 every day. <laughs> Alright, there's that side. We got a side view back board all the way. There's, oh, great back in there from Beta. Good parry there from Yep. Gonna get that up tilt. Beta's stuck in the area there, but Falling Gordo gonna, you know, get Yep right off of him. <laughs> that. I don't know, that, that freeze frame always confuses me. But good job there from Yep taking that with another classic Yep forward smash. And that down smash, not gonna hit. 
parries the Nair. Starts getting those up throw, up air combos. 64%. This match going basically the complete other way. Oh, but there's the forward smash coming up for Piet to take it. 1-1 one, one here. And on a, this, this set, both those games so far have been basically the complete opposite of each other. One player up a stock basically the entire game. I think you should go uh, Mario Maker. <laughs> Say, are we seeing the summit pick? Mario Bros? Oh, Battlefield. <laughs> Alright. Same characters, but we're seeing that Battlefield pick. It'll be really nice to actually see that little bit of change of scenery, you know? Not, I'm so sick of that stupid green field with that poke on those two platforms. Alright, but there's... This. Oh, no. Tech chase by DD out here. There's that... Back there, okay. Yep, hasn't been able to get a hit at all. Bit of has a jet hammer, but of course, you know. Haha, <laughs> what does jet hammer do against a side B? That's from Persona 5. There's the jab. Bora coming out. Air dodge just right through that up air. Yep, going for that chase and just gonna smack the Gordo back into him. There's an air, not gonna get the tech, but doesn't really quite matter because he's still living. Tries to get the spike, but you know, not gonna hit anybody. There's the backers coming in. Alright, there's the jab coming in from Yep, that fast little jab sucks in the side feed, not gonna do anything. There's the up tilt, not gonna kill. Yep, living at 135 here against DDD, the big fat penguin like man. Come on, just that's Oh man, he's using side feed. There's the down throw. There, there's that down tilt coming in. You know, great great move for DDD. Does so much. And oh no, my necklace fell. <laughs> Beta's still up the stock and... Alright, there's Gordo on ledge. Gonna save Beta a little bit there. Neutral get up. Back air. Up tilt. He's gaming. But there's that classic... Arsene back here coming out. Tries to get the spike, doesn't get it. And Gordo just gonna knock him away. Okay, there's another side to be there. Another one. Still not gonna kill. Does he get the other one? Yes, he does. To get this. Whoa! Fun fact, he does that in Persona 5. <laughs> yeah. All right, there's that. Yep, gonna try to rack up some damage here. Try to even up these percents. Maybe even get a kill on Beta before Beta can get a kill on him. Arsene is out, but Beta doesn't even need Arsene when he's got that up tilt. Great move there. <laughs> he's Gordoing. He's crazy. Big brain. All right, there's that down tilt coming out. Nair coming out. Great combo. Just stop it right there. That's just like, that's it. But there's the up smash. A little delayed. But hey. I don't know if he does that one in Persona 5. I'm going to be honest here. But who knows? Yeah. Joker's never up smashed in Persona 5. He might have done it in dancing. I don't know. Alright, but there's the side coming out. Pretty good. Just, you know. Back and forth, spot dodging that grab. Oh, he's so cool. Ah, it could have been, it could have been a clip. I could have went on Yeet Smash, but nothing happened. Now I'm sad. Ow. There's the Gordo, point blank. We're setting up. Probably shoot another one. Oh, there's an edge. Nice, good job. Who won?
Beta could win this. Yeah. Going instantly back to Battlefield? Dreamland? Small Battlefield. S just like Battlefield, but small. It's in the name, you know. And also it doesn't... Yep, it doesn't have that third platform, so, you know, that could change up some stuff. I don't know. Did the third platform get used? I watched it a Buzz video once, and he said that top platform was a good thing. So we don't have that anymore, so... I'm right, instantly just gonna poke out that hammer with that forward tilt. Coming in there. Good damage racking up, 44% already on yet. Let's see, can he get more? Is he yep, just gonna get a bunch of these up airs? And oh, there's a good old Dedede neutral B. That suck. Coming in. There is again. She's off stage. But there's a stupid little splash screen. Why does it keep appearing? All right, that side be barely not gonna hit Beta. Beta's gonna back air twice and hit nothing. But yeah, gonna get a lot of these juggles out. Not letting Beta get off the ground, off you know, the air. Bleh. That killed. I was not expecting that to kill, but hey, you know what? Joke on you. There's up tilt. Classic beta moment right there with that up tilt. And there's the upper juggles coming in from you. Yeah. Alright, dash attack. Rebels guard. Okay. Up air. Up air. <laughs> jumps on his head. Alright. Yep, has a lot of percent on beta here. There's that grab coming out from the shield. Has him off the stage a little bit in the air. Oh! Arsene's out. Could get an easy kill here. And he does! The forwarder into up smash! Apparently getting rid of that triplat, which the buzz said was good, makes all the difference in this match. Alright, there's the back airs coming out. Oh, he's going deep. But he survives, of course, because he does have the big scary top of band. Not anymore. Maybe we hit him away. Does he come back? There's... No! He barely misses it. Yep, has 86% on beta here. Can he secure stock? Or is, you know, beta gonna get a bunch of percent? He's getting a bunch of percent already. 30, 40 something. I can't count. There's the jet hammer. Oh, <laughs> beta is so hype. Dude, it's so much easier to land if I use my gun. <laughs> and that's, yep. And that's, that's, that's reset, right? Yeah. Yep, that's reset. <laughs> Yeah, PS2! Joker. Joker. Beta Roy? <laughs> you won the last set with the DVD. It was like, you know what? <laughs> Roy. <laughs> Coming in here, dash attack after dash attack, 4 yep. And just not gonna leave Beta alone. Tons of da damage, tons of combos. Says I'm at 69%. That's a funny number. Everybody laugh. And I was expecting him to hit him out of it. But there it is. And Beta not able to get a hit here. Never mind. Down tilt. He doesn't need to hit him when, you know, you can just kind of roll out. And Nair after Nair there. Text away. Gordo point blank. All right. There's that Gordo in the side. Saibi coming out, though. And there's the back air from Yep. Such a strong move when you have that arson back air, you know. You're gonna kill anybody and everybody who comes near that knife. Okay, beta gonna throw him off stage. You know, gonna just yeah, whatever. English. It's a language. I speak it sometimes. Alright, beta gonna land with that nair. Spot dodges the grab. Really just good play here from Yap. Not letting Beta get in, try to and use one of his kill moves there. That's the thing, did you got a lot of random kill moves. That's what happens when you're a heavy. 91%. There's the up air. Get up attack, but Rebels guards it. He has our set again. Could get another easy stock here. But nope, there's the forward tilt. 
155 still living. Trying to use that side. We go. There's a jackhammer. All right. Yep has 94% on beta here. And again, usually from what I've seen from these games is whoever gets that lead first keeps that lead and then wins. We saw it in all four of those previous games. And we're probably going to see it here now. Who knows? Maybe beta will surprise us. It's not looking like it, though, as he hasn't got a single hit on yet. yet. And there's the Gordo just bouncing all over the place. There's Beta with that back air. Good old 15%. Oh, but there's forward air stuff coming out from Yep. Maybe? No. Oh, he's jumping. He's crazy. Four, up smash, not going to hit anybody. Trying to expect a roll there, maybe? All right. But he does have Arsene. Arsene could be an easy kill, but it also means a stronger side before Beta to inhale. There's the back air. It's not going to kill. I was honestly expecting it, you know. Maybe I'm too Arsene pills. I think it's way too strong. Beta at 200 right now. Still living. Never mind. Gets kicked into the blast zone. Has 84% on Yep, though. But of course, Yep still has that stock advantage. And again, every time someone has the advantage in this set, they've won the game. We're going to have to see if that works out in Yep's favor. Good parry there. The jab coming out. Saibi just going to slowly droosh over Beta's head. Tries getting that back if I can't because just that Joker Nair is so fast. We've seen you have to use it again and again just to get out of Beta's things. Pivot Grab going to be hitting nobody, but Beta going to answer back with a Nair of his own. Still not going to kill because Yep is at 134, but, you know, it's not going to kill across the stage in the air. But there's the down tilt. Not going to kill, surprisingly, but that's going to kill. Giant Hammer to the face. Out stage there. And Beta's trying to even up these percents with these up tilts, with these DDD juggles. All right, there's that down air. Forward air. The spike coming in. Back air. Wow, Beta evening this up really well. And there's a jet hammer. Game one going to Beta of this Grand's reset. Same bands as usual for Beta. I'm going back to PS2. Doesn't surprise me, honestly. But, like, I, I want more stages. This is why if I get to make my own stage list, we're not doing PS2. <laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> All right. A huge thing about these games is who can get these combos off first. And it's looking like Yep's gonna get them off first, but it doesn't really matter when Beta answers back and does more damage, which is, again, just a couple of hits, because big old heavy does big hit win. Gordo's on ledge there. Yep, got a back air after that down throw. Gun? Oh my gosh. Yep using gun, uh-oh. There's the side B. Down throw. Up tilt. Bonja backers coming out. This is average RSN gaming right here. He does that in Persona 5. Fun fact! Start! 1-1-1. One, one, one. Joker's percent right now. And Beta just gonna take that stock. Instantly evening it up. 2-2. Two, two, zero stocks. What? That that wasn't right. Whatever. Womp womp. And there's the juggles coming in from Yep. Crazy damage. Using that grappling hook from Persona 5 Royal to extend that combo just a little bit more. And huge damage on Beta right here. But Beta's going to finally start getting some damage of his own just with those great reversals with that inhale. The great little move to rip up your opponent. Spit him out wherever you want. It's great. Gordo not going to snap the ledge there. Just going to bounce right off. Good point blank one. Yep, does have Arsene here. But if, hey, if Beta can hit him enough, that meter will go down faster. But Yep is at funny number. Let's see if that has any play here. It does because that forward air on the smash is going to take the stock for Yep. 
Alright, and there's the combos coming off again and again. Of course, Beta using that great combo breaker in that nair. Point blank. Gordo not gonna kill. There's the Gordo snipe though. Still not gonna kill. Yep, living at 118. 124 as he rebel guards it. But there's the up air from Heavens, but the tech's gonna save Yep's life there. 145. Arsene's back. Not for long though. That back air is gonna take that stock. Coming in there. Has Beta on ledge. Using a lot of these back airs. And a little bit of the side B as well. Rebels guarding nothing. Rebels guard something there. That's right. There's that forward air. Arsene is really close to coming out now. There's a couple more hits and he'll be out. Of course, Yep not even letting Beta hit him enough for him to get it. All right. Has him on ledge. Trying to, you know, not get hit by those inhales. Trying to just see some safe on shield moves forward smash. That's not safe ever. All right, but there's that dash attack from Persona 5. Trademark Atlas. All right. There's that side B coming in. Maybe get the kill on Beta. There's that back throw living at one. Basically 80. Gordo stuck on ledge. That is honestly okay. Beta should have Gordo back now, but can't use it when Beta's, I mean, when Yep's pressuring the shield, and there's that up smash. 1-1 one, one right now. <laughs> FD Kalos bans. <laughs> and Battlefield being banned. He's seen the DeBuzz video about how good that tri-platform is. Yeah. <laughs> Shadow Moses Island? Smashville? <laughs> Find me? Wrecking Crew? <laughs> All right. All right, gonna just settle on Hollow Bastion there. Smashville, but from a cringe game. And it looks like we're gonna keep same characters. Of course, I shouldn't expect any counterpicks. <laughs> Until, you know, for some reason, one of them's gonna pull out the Olimar. It's gonna go crazy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's the grabs clanking. Makes sense, because I think these characters get so much off of these grabs. Just like that, Beta showing that with that up there, up air, 25%, and keeps Yep in the air to get two more up airs. Put the count on screen. All right, and there's that back air. But the Gordo's gonna start getting him out. There's the inhale, but Joker knife is gonna go through it. Tries getting the spike of some sort. Oh, the footstool! In there! Oh man. It could have been cool. <laughs> Rolls past the counter. It catches him with that up air, and that's gonna kill! At 92. Wow. Ooh. Okay. There's the backers coming out from Yep. Then you need to be able to take that stock. Nair's coming in from all sides. Yep, shield getting pretty low here. But it doesn't quite matter when you can hit a combo and get a kill. Even, even game here. It's not going to be an even game anymore if Yep keeps hitting these combos. 45% on beta. 60, 61, 62, 64, 65. All right, and there's the up air coming out from beta. Our set is almost out. Never mind, he's here. The beta is going to slap him away, throw him off. All right, Nair's on. Yep, shield. Back throw. Both these players just kind of throwing out moves, hoping something hits. Yep, trying to use those back airs, but that Gordo's just gonna fling right through. Trying to get that forward to doesn't get it. Yep, now has beta off stage. Can he get something from this ledge trap right here? He cannot. Coming in. Gordo going through. And there's the upper catches him. That's gone. That's dead. A beta, another stock ahead here. Is beta gonna keep pushing this lead? No, he's not because that forward air. Forward smash gonna take the stock. All right. Oh. Yep, is SDIing like crazy out there. 
26 percent 39 it would have been cool it would have been hype random forward smash but it's not gonna hit hey sometimes that random forward smash is actually pretty calculated forward smash but there's nothing calculated about spamming back air but hey guess what it's it's joker it works that's basically his character yeah he does do it in persona 5 Back throw coming out. Has beta on ledge. There's a forwarder. Gonna get nothing. There's the down smash. Has Arsene as well. A bunch of side beasts coming out. Just like he does in Persona 5. Gordo being spit back out. Back air, back air, back air. There's that nair. Another nair. Gonna catch that air dodge from. Yep. Gordo getting set back. That beta. Oh, and the star KO. Game 3 goes to Yep right there. Game four, match point. Yep, could take this. But of course, Beta, you know, he won that first set. You know, trying to just get, you know, something. Because if Beta won that reset for no reason, but... Beta finally picked Smashville. It's going crazy. Kakarot's rooting for the Beta comeback right here. Beta has the supporters in chat. Yep. <laughs> Alright. See, the issue is, as well, with this being a little bit later in the day, we don't get the good Animal Crossing back, which is like the, like, even, like, not evening, but like, sunset. Love that background for the Animal Crossing stages. But instead, we're getting the nighttime. There's constellations. I don't know any of the names. There's one where one dips bigly and one where it dips smallly. But yeah, and gameplay-wise, there is no big nor little dipper here. Because it's really even. Jab coming out from beta. Tiny stage, tiny everything. Catches him with that up air, and it's going to kill. No, it's not. I lied. My bad. I didn't say that one was going to kill because I knew it wouldn't. I've improved. Yep, yeah, just going to roll back. Has a beta on ledge. Catches the ledge hang with a side B. Beta. Running around in air. Catching with up airs of his own, but it's not as effective when beta does it. Because that DDD up air is super strong, but that forward air is super strong. Going to take the stock off of beta. I mean, I, I've... From uh, m my knowledge of watching MK Leo sets, Smashville is a good stage for Joker. But up tilt. <laughs> All right, pretty even game here. Yep, only has 26% on beta. Never mind, I lied. As, as Yep's gonna hit a little bit of a combo there, bring it up to 40. But Yep gonna SDI for his life as beta's hitting a lot of these up airs. Tech, up tilt, up air. All right. Back air. Okay. Gordo just gonna go right through that side B. Gordo setup's going crazy. Back air, back air, back air, back air. All right. Down tilt. Okay, good forward air there. Gonna knock back Gordo. Has beta on ledge. Gordo's sending yet back here. Yep, okay, gonna Rebels guard. Probably try to get that Gordo, but doesn't get it. Oh, there's, there's the Joker. Forward air, drag down. Up air, drag down into up smash. Classic Joker moment, especially for a stage here like Smashville. But beta just gonna slam. Oh, Gordo's knife, he's so cool even game here this could be this could be the end of grants if yep can win here but it's not looking like his beta's gonna hit a huge combo but so is yep it gets some up air juggles there's the up throw not letting beta down back here coming out yep constant pressure on beta here there's the fort not beta just it doesn't it just feels like he doesn't have anywhere to go even those calm little moments yep's waiting as soon as he has an opening goes in hits and that was something all right running on beta shield there backers coming out he does have our son big scary top hat man 
But there's the up air coming in from Beta and the kill. Oh, we're going to game five. Game five, game five. It's game five. It was, it was 3 1. Okay. The first set. So it's game nine. No. We were so close. Pokemon Stadium 2. Again, the beta fan club in chat's going crazy right now. Yes, go beta, that's my go. Yo, yeah, beta! Yep, kick my cat. <laughs> <laughs> And of course, for the last set of this Grand Finals, we gotta go back to PS2. I liked having different stages, but oh well. And Beta gonna start off with a huge combo. There's 61%, and just keeps going with those edge cards. There's the there. And oh, you hate to see that. Does that count as an SD? All right. The juggles coming out from you up there. Can he bring this back? After, you know, Beta went for that crazy Edgard killing him really early. Of course, he does have Arsene. Big, scary top hat, man. That means he has back air. But Beta has Nair. So, like, you know. But there's that back air. Back air's coming in. Get out there, forward air. All right. Down throw. Trying to set something up here. Beta going for a big ol' off smash, but it doesn't work for him, and he ends up getting punished. Yep, gotta take that stock. Trying to even it up here. Beta still has that 61 62. My apology. Percent. Yep, going for a lot of these juggles. Crazy combos, trying to even up that percent as fast as he can. Beta has that nair into that forward air. Yep, does have our send. And that could be huge for him. That means a lot more damage with a lot more kill power. Just like in Persona 5. There's that forward tilt. 110 on yep. There's the setup. His shield super low. Down tilt coming in. Tries to go for the corner slate. Doesn't get it though. There's a downer. Doesn't work. There's the nair though, and that's gonna take the stock. Beta is still an entire stock ahead here. Can yep even it up? Can yep win this, or is it just gonna be a beta? We do have the beta fan club in chat. Alright, four tilt. Beta gonna tech roll away. Parries it. Up tilt. No up air coming after that. Up tilt, just another one. That forward air one. So good. But so is that Nair. Speaking of Nair, Joker Nair. Okay. Beta fan club going crazy in chat. There's the back here though coming after her. Yep. He's setting up some ledge traps here with those side bees. He's gonna use a bunch of them. Parries the Gordo. There's another backer coming in. Side bees. Inhales it, but barely misses. Yep, right there. Back air. Hudson, how do you feel about this match? Uh, beta is my go, so I hope he wins. Yeah. But it looks like it's looking pretty good for Beta. It is. I did see Beta live to like 200 earlier today. Oh, yeah. Against Easy. So. He's done it multiple times today, actually. He's been living a long time in a lot of these matches. And yet, pretty, away, pretty far away from Arsene. Mm -hmm. Yeah, of course, he's just, like, one good Rebels guard away. And plus, we've seen Yep live to some crazy percents today, too, so... Oh, oh but he can't live to a crazy percent against that up tilt. Beta wins Grands after the reset. The Beta fan club in chat, a.k.a. Big Do, is going crazy. Good tournament. Good that's, bracket. That's it. That's you have it. Any final words? Final words. Um, Listen to the podcast when that comes out. Sure. Arpeggio! Come, come, uh, talk about your podcast. Yeah, come on. It's final we'll first time. Stream. We, we, we. <laughs> Hi, guys. Podcast. I, I heard Arpeggio come over here. Podcast. Yeah, I heard That's, it. I came running. Tell them about your podcast yeah. real quick before podcast. we start so, the stream. We do got a podcast. I'm going to be putting it up on YouTube and bare minimum uh, Spotify as well. Uh, check out it, it might be a working title it might not be Weber State Smashculation I don't know why we find it funny as we do 
Uh, first episodes got me, Edge, Kakarot, and Cyrus on the Dream mic. Dream team. Uh, you should check it out sometime. Um, since I'm here, let's hit him with the tradition. Do we got like um? Oh, are they gonna do stream doubles? No, I'm about to turn off the. Hudson, okay. Hudson doesn't moral, like. Moral, moral of the story today. What have we learned? What have we learned? Because uh, I hate fun. Okay, okay, okay. More moral of the story. Hudson hates fun. Uh, Hudson and Yep. Uh, no, not Hudson. Sorry, sorry. Easy and Yep kick animals. Beta lives to 200% too often, and um, items in stamina mode on stream are very funny. All and I gotta say is, if you guys listen to the podcast, then you'd know who gets the 2023 award of Clutch King, and it might not be relevant to the results of today's tournament. See ya. <laughs> I don't know. What? Thanks for watching.